Hey everybody, good morning and happy Saturday. Y'all, I'm coming on, um, I showed you in the first video these glasses. Well, I made a couple other creations while I was um, working last night, just messing. I like to mess, y'all know how I am. But I made a couple other things. Now, the when I picked up these two vases, I also picked up this round box from the Dollar Tree. It's just a gift box and very simple, uh, just, just plain old box. But I decorated up the lid of it because I wanted to use this for a uh, present. So I took, loaded down my flowers and pearls. I made a little bow out of uh, my little ribbon to go here and I added my butterflies. And then I took every bit of this and sprayed it with my glisten spray which just made everything shimmer. I hope you can see that. It is gorgeous, but it makes just such a pretty, pretty box. But the reason I needed this box is, y'all know we make the Christmas ornaments, the occasion ornaments, out of these little glass globes from Dollar Tree. Well, this is some I had made using the shells, and I wanted a way to be able to package this up and send it so I know it wouldn't get hurt. And very simple, very clean, but inside, I just decorated it with all the shells and everything inside the shell. Added it on just a little yellow platform and then fixed it like this. And of course, I added my flowers to the top. But anyway, I think that is just great. They got, the Little Mermaids has got the little bubbles coming out and this is some of the smaller stuff. So this right here now will fit perfectly in there. I can add a little cotton around the top or a little paper and now I have a way to send this. They will have a useful gift plus a pretty little decoration inside and I just love the idea. I hope you do. So very simple. Just just creating the way I see it. And then the second thing I done, I made a card and y'all, I tell you what, I tried to get clean on this one and <laughs> I ended up wanting a little more stuff to it, but this is the way it came out. Isn't that cute? And it says, Gather Happy Moments. And of course, I used the kind of uh, brownish pearls to this instead of the white. And I added this little ribbon I found. And this ribbon came from, uh, what is it? The Pop Shelf. Anyway, and it was a dollar, but it is very sheer ribbon. And it's got these little... Uh, dots on it and I think that is so cute. I did not know they sold ribbon and things like that until somebody had told me a while back and then when I went in fact I picked up like five rolls of ribbon. I think that was all I bought there was like five rolls of ribbon but anyway it, it just made a cute little detail. I just fanned them out and made a little detail there and then on the inside I just added a couple strips of the paper. I added a little piece of the uh ribbon there and one little piece there just so it'll coordinate back to the front of the card but anyway i think that's cute and then just one of the uh green uh prima flowers so that worked out pretty good and i'll put that in my stash and save it to when i need it now the same thing i did someone had sent me these handmade art and they were just frames nothing was in the frames no pictures or anything but it was frames that you could put stuff in so what I did to these to get them ready for me to use, I got out my Prima Puffy stickers, those 26 pieces in this pack. I went around the border of these frames and added different elements to it. This one says Together Always, and it has the little boy and girl lighting the birthday cake. And just, I added the little bow, uh, roses here. This was already decorated. I added a teapot in the heart and then teacups to the side of it to look like it's getting ready for a tea party. This one says best of friends and it's got beautiful rose bottom and then I added her to the top and then added the roses up here and the three hearts coming down. This one I added another one of my beautiful Victorian ladies from the Prima and then a shoe up here and then a heart here. These were already made and then I'll have two pretty flowers to decorate too. But isn't that adorable? And y'all, these are about the size of twinges. And these, I made these to go back on ATC cards though. 
So, you know, i got a few pieces left over I can add on, but I think that's pretty so. Even when you're looking at stickers, think how it could be added to or decorated with. That's what I like to do. So, anyway, I hope you like some of these inspirations. I hope you'll try them. And like I said, this right here, you know, just thrilled me to be able to come up with something to be able to send these in besides in just a baggie and wrapped in plastic and praying that they get there in one piece. So, I hope you like this. All right. Hugs, love, and kisses, and have a blessed, beautiful day. Sleep with the angels every night. Know I love you. Bye, babies.